Rooftop tents are becoming an increasingly popular alternative to ground tents, particularly among overlanders, road trippers, and off-roaders. This video outlines the pros and cons of using a rooftop tent vs ground tent. A rooftop tent mounts to your vehicle's roof rack or roof ball. The tent folds or collapses down into a flat, aerodynamic package that stays mounted to your roof while you drive. When you're ready to camp, you simply fold the tent out or pop it up, depending on the design. Most models include a comfortable foam mattress. You sleep off the ground on the vehicle's roof. Faster and easier to set up. Generally, rooftop tents take less time and effort to set up than ground tents. A well-designed hard shell rooftop tent can be set up by one person in less than 60 seconds. You simply unlock some latches, pop the tent up with the help of some gas struts, then lock it in place with safety supports. Easier to find a campsite. It is generally easier to find a suitable campsite when you're using a rooftop tent. All you need to look for is a flat place to park. It doesn't matter if the ground is wet, rocky, muddy, lumpy, or covered in snow or vegetation more comfortable. Rooftop tents integrate a mattress into the floor of a tent. Rooftop tent mattresses tend to be thicker, larger, and more comfortable than ground tent sleeping pads. For example, most rooftop tents include a 2-1-slash-2-3-inch thick foam mattress that offers plenty of back support. Better view. Rooftop tents put you 5-6 feet off the ground, depending on the height of your vehicle. This allows you to enjoy an unobstructed view of your surroundings while you're in your tent. You can store your bedding and some gear inside a rooftop tent. Many rooftop tents are designed in a way that leaves a bit of space inside when they are closed. This way, you can leave your sleeping bag, blanket, pillow, and sleep pad set up at all times. This saves you a great deal of time and effort when setting up camp. Rooftop tents offer less living space. Most rooftop tents are designed to sleep two people comfortably. They are similar in size to two-person ground tents. Pop-up models are limited to the size of the vehicle's roof. Worse fuel efficiency. Rooftop tents stick up from the top of your roof. This creates wind resistance which reduces your fuel economy. Exactly how much your gas mileage will suffer depends on a number of factors including the type of rooftop tent you choose, the type of vehicle that you drive, your speed, your driving habits, the way you mount the tent, the tent's weight, and more. Rooftop tents are expensive. Rooftop tents are much more expensive than ground tents. Decent soft shell models run around $1,000, $1,500. Hard shell models run between $1,500, $3,500. Budget models are available starting at around $800. High-end models with all the bells and whistles run upwards of $5,000. Prices have come down over the past few years, but rooftop tents are still pretty expensive for what they are. Rooftop tents make the vehicle top-heavy. Installing a rooftop tent adds 100-200 pounds to the top of your vehicle. This raises your vehicle's center of gravity, which can be a safety issue. Your vehicle becomes easier to tip with so much weight sitting so high up. Worse performance and handling. Rooftop tents can add so much weight that they cause the vehicle's suspension to sag. This is most likely when you install a particularly heavy rooftop tent or install a rooftop tent on a vehicle that is when your suspension is overloaded, your vehicle's handling suffers. You will really notice this when driving off-road because your suspension won't have as much travel. Rooftop tents are heavy. The average rooftop tent weighs between 100 and 220 pounds, 45-100 kg. One of the lightest rooftop tents is this super light roof tent that weighs just 80 pounds. The weight of rooftop tents makes them hard to install, move around, and store. They are cumbersome. The wheat also hurts your vehicle's efficiency in handling. To compare, an average ground tent weighs just 5 tons, which is negligible. Cheap ground tents are incredibly affordable. You can buy a basic one for $30. A nice two-person ground tent goes for $100, $300. Big yard style ground tents start at around $750 and max out at around $1,500. More living space ground tents are available in much larger sizes than rooftop tents. Some models are large and tall enough that you can stand up and walk around inside. A big ground tent can comfortably sleep eight or more people. This kind of setup works great for those who want to sleep inside the same tent with their whole family and pets. More versatile, you can use a lightweight ground tent for car camping. 
bicycle touring, motorcycle touring, hiking, hunting, travel, and more. You don't need a vehicle to use it. You can also use any vehicle or swap vehicle. Ground tents allow you to camp away from your vehicle using a ground tent gives you the freedom to separate yourself from your vehicle. This can come in handy in several situations. Fast and easy to set up and take down modern ground tents are incredibly fast and easy to pitch. For example, I can pitch my big Agnes Fly Creek HVU loan in less than two minutes if I'm in a hurry. This is faster than many rooftop soft shell rooftop tents. Less comfortable one major difference between ground tents and rooftop tents is the sleeping pad. Standard ground camping sleeping pads are generally thinner, more narrow, and less comfortable than rooftop tent mattresses. Harder to find a campsite finding a suitable site to pitch a ground tent can be a time-consuming job. You need to find a flat spot without any lumps, rocks, or thorns. In addition, you also need to make sure you're not setting up in a spot that could get flooded if it starts raining. Less durable ground tents are made from low denier, thin fabric, and lightweight materials. This is necessary because the tent needs to be light enough to carry around. The drawback is that these lightweight materials tend to be more fragile. More dangerous when you're sleeping on the ground. You're a bit more exposed to wild animals. A bear can wander into camp and start sniffing around right outside of your tent. It's rare for an animal to attack a camper in a ground tent, but it does happen. Less consistent sleep every campsite is a bit different. Sometimes you'll end up pitching your tent on a rock, dip, incline, or hump. When this happens, you'll get a poor night of sleep. With a rooftop tent, you're always sleeping on a flat surface. We are going to end this video right away. If you have any query or information to share, please leave a comment below. Thanks for watching.